Welcome to the Moisberger Technical Tip. With three plate moulds, the following question often arises. Which is the right latch lock for the current project? We're therefore pleased to present to you our E1820 flat latch lock. With the flat latch lock, it is possible to control two split line faces while the third plate is locked. Depending on the type, not delayed or delayed, the first or the second split line face is initially opened. When the first stroke is reached, the switching segments are moved outwards over the chamfers of the pulling rod and locked by means of spring-loaded pins. The floating plate is secured in position. The second split line face is then opened and the component can be demolded. In the shop, the correct size and number can be determined by using the selection guide and entering the desired parameters. Additionally, a delay can be selected. The information on the datasheet helps determine the correct size and number. The datasheet also shows details such as the switching clearance, the switching zone, the locking force and the traction force. The flat latch locks should always be positioned symmetrically. When the correct latch lock has been selected, the 3D model is shown in live view. By entering stroke 1, the delay is further adjusted. The ready-to-install 3D model can then be exported. The only detail missing in the CAD is the individual holes for the screws and pins. Further machining of the pulling rod and the housing is done according to information from the CAD or the catalogue. The pulling rod and the housing can also be cut to length if required. The following steps are required to mount the flat latch lock. Once the housing and the pulling rod have been mounted, the mould can be closed. To avoid damage during closing, make sure that the floating plate is in the locked position. the maintenance effort is minimized due to the precisely milled guide curves, the case hardened running surfaces, the integrated stop dampers made from technically modified PU and the DLC coated switching elements. In general, we recommend lubricating the contact surfaces with the VLS 250 high performance oil every 250 hours of operation. Let's now take a look at the advantages of the E1820 flat latch lock. A compact design with stable large surface latches, accurate switching thanks to precise hard milled guide curves, and integrated stop dampers for quiet and gentle operation. 